this. It's a uh, doctor bag for a day hand here locally, a good friend of mine. And uh, anyway, we're going to make this today because it's been like a couple of weeks, maybe a month, since he ordered it. But anyway, he needs it. Uh, it's just a double medicine bag. It's going to hold two 500 mil bottles, probably not this exact bottle. But um, anyway, we're going to try to make this real quick uh, this morning, and that way he can get it and uh, put it to work. It's going to be a pommel bag that will hang off the front of the front of the saddle there where he can get to his stuff. So we're going to go ahead and get that started and see if we can make that right quick.
Okay, so that's how I did that bag. So I just kind of had to do it kind of fast this morning. So we just kind of made patterns as we were going. So you got to see a little bit of that on how I approach making a pattern, how I kind of figured that out. So this is our bag here after some oil. So this little pocket right here is gonna be for extra needles. So you can put the uh, extra needles for the syringes in that little pocket there. Uh, a syringe will go in here. I made this for a 35 cc syringe. And then inside here, you know, we've got two double pockets there for 500 mil bottles of medicine. So if we're using, you know, whatever he's gonna put in here, they'll fit right here. They've got some holes in the bottom where they'll hang down. So the bottles are going upside down then he'll be able to uh, draw out whatever medicine that he needs to doctor the cattle. But that's our bag right there. That hole right there, I did a three inch hole on there so it'll fit over most horns. If you're riding a weight saddle, you'd obviously need to make that hole much bigger. But, but um, and that just made this out of nine, nine, 10 ounce Latigo, the pockets. And this is nothing more than just a four, six ounce, I think, or five, six, a little bit thinner Latigo. But it makes a nice little even bag. I'm gonna put a couple ties uh just saddle strings down here on the bottom where he can tie them no matter what side of the of the pommel he's going to put it on he'll be able to kind of lash that down to a d-ring or whatever he wants to do but uh, buckle straps easy to replace if they break and they will break at some point because they probably won't get oiled and they will get tore up so so that's a quick easy bag to make for just a medicine bag so just something cool i thought y'all might like to see us make okay so there's our bag there's our patterns that we made uh this morning as we were doing it so these patterns will be available on our website there'll be a link down in the description if you'd like to purchase those patterns for these um, like I said, you can use the video to kind of go through and see how I put it together, change it up however you would like it. If you want to do the buckle a little different or if you're going to make uh, for a wade, you know, or if you're going to do it for a wade saddle, then you would obviously want to make this bigger so that you can cut a bigger hole in there. I would advise leaving some distance around here um, depending on the size of the hole that you make because that will get tore off pretty easily um, if, if you make it too narrow. So I hope you enjoyed the video. hope you enjoyed how kind of watching me go through making something that we don't have patterns for that we don't know, you know, we haven't made yet. And this was definitely something that I had never made before. Um, I've made some of these, but not this exact way. So, so thank y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, it was a good, it was a good little project to do. Like I said, I put it off for quite a while. Um, I think he ordered it uh, back in January and I just now remembered about it. And so we had to kind of hustle to get it done this morning. I thought y'all might like to watch, um, how I kind of go about putting one of these together when I don't really know exactly what I'm building. Um, I didn't really have a pattern or a size. He just said I need two bottles, syringe, some needles. I need, I need them on the front of my saddle, not on the back, like most people have them. And so we came up with that and kind of went from there. We started with the, that sketch I showed you and um, he kind of approved that and said, yeah, that'll work. So, but anyway, that's how I made the bag. Hope you enjoyed it. Got any questions, email me. Patterns are down in the description. Please give us a like. Subscribe if you like the channel and you want to continue to see more of them. And uh, we'll see you at the, on the next video.